Morning crew, I've made the last minute call to burn down to Mermaid Reef from the Gold Coast Seaway to have a crack at the Spotty Max. I'll be using my homemade trolling rigs. I'll show you how these are made at the end of the vid.
A spotty favourite is the Western Australian Pilchard, which is readily found in most service stations and other bait outlets, although the fresher the better. Often trolling baits, either dead or alive, will outperform trolling lures, just to ensure that the bait is defrosted before using it. When setting up a rig for small baits such as pilchards, yakkers or slimies, you will need 28 pound single strand wire or 38 to 44 pound if you are targeting both spotties and spaniards, a 59 pound black barrel swivel, a VMC treble hook, a 5.0, 6.0 or 7.0 mustard live bait hook, a size 3 or 4 oval bean sinker and a pink, white or blue squid skirt. Some fishers scale the hook size right down to a 3.0 size and go with a lighter gauge hook, which is also fine. To start, cut the bean sinker with a hacksaw to create a gape and affix to the hook by closing tightly with pliers, crushing in a vise or with a hammer. Attach 25 or 30 centimeters of single strand wire to the eye of the live bait hook with a haywire twist knot. Then attach to the barrel swivel 10 centimeters or so of wire from the eyelet of the hook to the VMC treble hook stinger. Add a swivel to the lead hook to prevent line twist. Troll the dead baits well back from the transom of your boat at around 40 to 50 meters and at around one to two knots.